Hi YouTube, this is a uh, quick video I wanted to make. Um, if you have a cat genie and you don't want to have it in the bathroom, it's actually quite big and obtrusive. Um, it's actually made to go in the bathroom and then there's a little hose that hooks over the edge of the toilet. I didn't want that. And I noticed on YouTube or on uh, online there was no videos of anyone who hard plumbed it in. And that's what I'm going to show you here. So basically here's my cat genie. Um, and I'll stand back so you can kind of see. This is the hose that would normally go to the um, back of the toilet, the water supply. And all I did, I actually have PEX um, plumbing. So I ran the, ran the line up my water line here. I put a T in my PEX line, which is over here. And then I have it a shutoff valve. And then I have my line to my Cat Genie going right there. So that's the water feed to it. And then the waste goes out the hose here beside my heater, over here, into a bucket. You can see here, let me pull this down. Into the top of a bucket. And then I have a hose that comes out of the side of that, as you can see, and that's watertight. And that goes behind my water tank there and right into my um, sump pump. So basically the way I did that, I made the, the the hose coming out, as you can see, is about five or six inches above the, the bottom of the bucket. And that allows any solids to settle to the bottom. Um, so only fluid is coming out of there. And if you have a cat genie, the fluid that comes out of there actually doesn't smell bad at all. It neutralizes the, the cat urine. So it's actually quite pleasant smelling. Um, and then my sump pump you know, functions as, as it normally would. And it takes about three months before I get a good amount of solids in the bottom of that. Uh, they get ground up pretty good, but uh, three months and I have to empty this out and I have it so that hose on the top just pops in and then that, um, that other hose just screws off and then I can empty it out. But that's it. So uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this helps someone. Uh, you can hard plumb them if you want to. I did it. Thanks. See ya.